If your life has to be enriched, you have to go through what people have gone through. We cannot in your life, no matter what you do, what kind of trouble you get into, you will still not go through what these people are going through in their lives, isn't it? It's too much drama, yes or no? Whatever kind of blunders you may do, still you cannot go through that kind of drama. So don't miss the drama, go through it. Without injury, we can go through a battle, what more? Without shame, we can go through all the shame. Without raging with hatred and somebody not doing anything to us, we can go through all that because there are two ways to grow. One by sheer transcendence that you stand above everything, untouched by the ways of life. Then you should have become a monk. This is a, a direct path that you're not interested in what happened in Mahabharata. You just sit here, roll your eyeballs up, you're somewhere else. Mahabharata means nothing to you if you want to take the truth. But you have not taken the truth, you've gotten into life. Now you better go through Mahabharat. Otherwise, you will create those situations. You go through it and you grow out of it. Otherwise, you may think these are all horrible situations. But please understand, every one of these emotions which led them to grand disasters exist within you and they are leading you to minor disasters because you're a minor human being compared to them. If you were a very big one, you would have gotten into big trouble. Because you are small, you get into small trouble, but small trouble does not create any less misery than big troubles. So, this is an opportunity to go through the situation, to live through the situation and grow out of it. Not to sit aloof and analyze, okay, is this guy good guy, is that guy bad guy? No, 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 all these people exist within you. All these emotions exist within you, all these strengths exist within you, all these weaknesses exist within you. Have you empowered your strength or your weaknesses is the question of your life, isn't it? Which one have you empowered within yourself? Accordingly, you are experiencing. So Mahabharata is not… it's not for entertainment we created all this. We thought you will grow out of many things in the process of living through what other people lived through. Because if you have to live through it, it would be life-wise too expensive. Even to simulate a live-through, it's pretty expensive. <laughs> if you have to live through it in life, it would be too expensive, isn't it? Not just in terms of money, in terms of life it would be too expensive.
I think uh, many subtle elements of what's happening here is being missed. In a very subtle way, we have been changing the decor, tuning the decor for the day, for the subject of the day, the mood of the day and the events of the day. I want you to enjoy it in its totality. Small changes, very subtle changes are happening on a daily basis. A lot of people might have missed it at least from now on, I want you to pay attention to it because individual lives become either rich or poor simply depending upon how much attention you are willing to pay to the detail of your life. I also lived or I lived the big difference. <laughs> I also lived on this planet is one thing. I lived on this planet is another thing. <laughs> That'll happen to you only when you're willing to pay attention to every detail of your life. That's yoga, how to sit, how to stand, how to breathe, how to do everything, how your heart should beat, how the life within you should pulse. When you pay attention to everything, you're in yoga.